Hunter, what's up? Mom wants us to stop by the house. Why? I don't know. You should tell us all. Tell you got a big case going on at work. It really hasn't been much since the Bloody How case last year. I don't care. You know how bad she got after you left. Just get us out of it, alright? No. Mom's a bitch, but that's no excuse to lie. We'll be quick. Here. Maybe she's asleep. You smell that? Psst, move. You're standing on the spare key, dumbass. <clears throat> oh! Mom? What are you doing? Calling the cops? No. We're handling this. We're not in Denver, Hunter. You see this? This used to be our mother. You really think I'd hand over her case to some dickweed country cop? Estimated time of death is between 24 to 36 hours. Bullet will pierce through a heart. No signs of death or sexual assault. What about this? No idea. Do you know where he shot from?
What are you looking for? You. The mirror suggests the killer had a piece for theatrics, heightening the fear in their victim when they see the reflection. However, she didn't see it coming. What does that say to you? Mirror must have been a trap then. Exactly. What was that for? We already took pictures. Maybe nothing. And then there's the question of the phone. Mom's phone? If mom's been dead for a day, who texted me this morning? Find mom's phone, find the killer. East of Eden by Steinbach. Since when was Mama book nerd? I'm going to go see who this Maeve Milliner is. Search the house for Mom's phone. Damien, you want a beer? No, I'm good. I can't believe she's dead. I just saw her yesterday. What time did you see her? Um, early afternoon. She needed to borrow this for the book club. How did she seem? She was worried. Said, um... Said this guy's been harassing her. She didn't mention a name? I can't remember. Is there a somewhere where I can... Uh... <clears throat> yeah. Thanks. I'll, I'll be done in a minute. I just have a couple more questions.
Okay, I can talk now. Detective Kane, to what do I have the pleasure? Hello, Al. Have you looked at those photos I sent? Tell me, Detective, when you saw the body of that poor woman, what was your first impression? She was dead. Did you allow yourself an impression beyond that? It was sloppy. Well, you hardly seem to be in need of my services with that acute sense of deduction. I don't have time for games. Be civil, Detective. You know how I hate when others are not civil. Have you ever wondered why it was you who caught me? Hal, I'm not here to talk about me. Tell me your thoughts on those photos. Cruelty received at an early age makes cruelty easily imagined. Do you enjoy hunting, Detective? I do. Have you ever hunted finches? No, I have not. Ah, yes. You strike me as the sort of man who only hunts the big game. Do you know how finches are hunted? Sure, you'll enlighten me. Hunters use the finch's narcissism against them. I believe you know the type, your mother being a clinical narcissist. The most dangerous weapon against a finch detective is not a knife or a gun. Finches are hunted with mirrors. The reason why it was you who caught me is because we were one and the same. I am nothing like you. The only difference between you and me, detective, is our choice of prey. I believe our time is up. Happy hunting, Detective Kane. Wait, well. You've had better luck than we have. I did. I found the shooter. What? I lost her. So you gotta be ready. If she's headed towards the house, she'll beat me there.
Put the gun on the ground! Now! The hood. My brother sends his regards. <laughs> you do look like bloody house victims. I was his muse. Looks like he was a bad teacher. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had it this easy catching a killer. Damien! Oh, thank God. I thought she got you too. Milo's dead. second brother I killed today. You killed Milo? Why? Because I hate you. Peace, brother. I know. <laughs> 